Oh, sort of. Sort it's of. um, it's always interesting when Puno and Kuhuku play. There's a certain well, there's always the competition, but then there's a there's a ties between the two communities that are interesting, unique, unique in all the whole, the whole country, I think, and it showed tonight. Um, there's a lot of. It's uh, interesting that Alakai is the guy who made maybe the biggest play defensively. Yeah. Well, it means a lot to him. Now, those are his friends, and, and the reality is, you always want to beat your friends more than anybody else. So there's still a lot of love for for the community and. And everybody a lot of respect, so it, it's it's really nice for them to make that play. What was it like to watch your team, you know, take the, the ground and pound of Kuku? I mean, they came it's off. Tough. With... They're big. They're strong. They're, they run the ball great. Um, I'm sure I, I I feel good now, but when I look at the stats, maybe not quite as good because it seemed like they were moving up and down the field. But you know, our kids rose to the challenge. It's not that we had to. I'm really proud of them, and uh, I'm proud of Kuku too. They fight. They don't give up. You know, there's no uh, give up on either team, and when you win, you know, you've earned it. The defense has played every kind of offense now, this year, yeah. and they've come through. And the only team, they're the only team that's played within six points of St. Louis. St. Louis is pretty good. You know, we got a big game next week with Milani. I know they're excited to play us. Um, like everybody says, it's a battle in the open division. It's, it's great. I hope we continue to do it. Uh, it just brings a lot of people to the ballpark. It's, it's uh, creating new rivalries. Uh, so I, I'm hopeful that we can continue to do it. We're looking forward to playing Milan. They're a great team. Rod does a good job. So, But we're going to enjoy this win tonight. There's some talk. I need to ask you this one last question. There's some talk I'm hearing about that St. Louis will split off possibly and do an independent schedule. That's none of your business. But it could affect the open division where they would split into two. Where it would be like a, I don't know, like a higher group within the, within the open and another group within the open. I don't know what's going on. Can you, <laughs> you have any idea? Uh, this is the first I've even thought of it. I'm just hoping we have opportunities to play the top teams every year. I think it's good for football. It's good for interest. Um, well, from what I hear, like pretty much everything else below that will remain intact. Cause, like today was a perfect example. Triple hitter, interleague, three great games. Yeah, they're all good games, yeah. good competition. Um, yeah. A lot of interest, you know. So I'm hopeful we'll continue to do it in the future. And uh, I, I can't speak for others because I know we're grateful to have the chance to play in the open division. Thank you, Bruce. Appreciate it. Thank you.